am Santiago, the warrior priest. I am Don Temple of Leon. I am Del Mal of Valiente. And I'm Sir Skepla, keeper of the Great White North. I court a lady with respect and with patience. I court a lady by conquering her father's castle and forcing her to be my bride until she dies from childbirth. A knight always has respect, doesn't rush anything, and really lives by the code of chivalry. Yeah, chivalry is important, I guess, but medieval battle etiquette doesn't really have much to do with women. How a court lady is first, I would meet their mother or their father and ask if I take their princess out. Yeah, they probably say no though, right? I mean, no king would really want their princess to marry a black knight. Why are you looking at me like that? Black knights are rogue knights that aren't loyal to a master. You can't trust somebody like that. An ideal first date for a knight would be a humongous meal, maybe in a meadow. What? A humongous meal in a meadow? What kind of resources do you have for something like this to be possible for you? Besides, dude, don't waste all your money on so much food on the first date. Proper ladies aren't supposed to eat a lot of food anyways. She'll just take a couple little bites and say she's full even though she's not. It might involve some type of tournament where other knights might be fighting and there would be jousting and horseback fighting. <laughs> You're gonna take her to a tournament where other knights are fighting? You wanna look like a giant pussy on your first date? No, dude, on my first date, I'm gonna impale a motherfucker on my lance. Some blood and teeth fly in the air. Let my date know that I'm a fucking badass. Hopefully I don't lose. Then the champion may take her home and force her to be his wife. That'll be your life from then on. Chivalry is dying, but not dead. Oh no, chivalry's definitely dead. The other day I defeated a knight in combat, and when I forced him to surrender and pay me a ransom, they called me a monster. Always to be respect your princess, no matter what. Treat her like you would treat your queen. She's already a princess, dude. Do you really need to elevate her higher than that? She's gonna get so fucking full of herself, she'll never respect you. Treat your princess as you would want to be treated. How am I supposed to provide her with strong sons? Who are these fucking pretty boys that you paired me up with here? From the looks of their big goofy smiles, I doubt they've even seen combat in their lifetimes. Have you guys ever even seen blood before? Do not force dating. I remember my first battle. The English, we didn't see them coming. And really do not rush it. The fields, they were soaked with the wretched stench of blood. We lost so many good soldiers that day. Just let it happen. Born had just inherited his father's sword. He was so proud. He was so young. Don't go out looking for anything. The screaming. I'll never forget the screaming. The horrific wails are forever etched in my memory. Because you might just pick something that you shouldn't have picked. How was your night? Do you need a new one? I've always treated my daughter like a princess. I just recently traded her off for marriage to improve relations with Scandinavia. Thank you for watching. If you like what you saw and you'd like to see more Armored Skeptic, please subscribe. If you absolutely love me, you can support me on Patreon. Or if you have a passing affection for me, you can buy my t-shirt. Links in the description. Treat your princess as you would want to be treated. I don't know, I'm not really that good at making sandwiches. Treat your princess as you would want to be treated. You mean like spend the whole day on my knees? Treat your princess as you would want to be treated. I can't suck her c- <laughs>